In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use multiple key signatures in the same project in Logic Pro for iPad. Let's go. To set a key signature for your entire project, you can simply tap at the top here and dial in either a major or a minor key by selecting your options and hitting done. But what if you want to use multiple keys? Let's show you that now. First, you need to show or unhide the key signature track. And to do that, we tap on our global tracks view here, tap and hold in this blank space and tap on key signature. By default, this this key signature is going to match whatever you've set as your global project key. In order to change that, we simply tap and hit the edit button and we can change it directly in the key signature box. To change the key signature during the project, simply put your playhead at the point where you'd like the change to take place and hit the plus button. You'll now get the key signature dialog box. You can dial in whatever key signature you want to change it to and hit the done button. You'll see we've now got two separate key signatures in this same project. To adjust the point where the change takes place, simply grab this handle and drag it to the left or right. You'll notice that there's no handle at the end of a key because you need to have at least one key signature on the project at all times. So if you want to change where it's actually going to change, simply drag it to the left or the right. To edit the key signature you've set, simply tap, tap on the edit button and you can adjust it here using the same parameters. And to delete a change, simply tap, tap again, and hit the delete button. And you can also use multiple tempos and multiple time signatures right here in the global track in Logic Pro for iPad. There's more videos showing you how to do all of that and a whole bunch more down in the description.